What's up, challengers? Welcome to the gym. My name's Gym Leader Geo, and this is episode zero of my Pokemon Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon Blind Let's Play. So, for those of you who are new to the channel, uh, this video is really just an explanation of what a blind Let's Play is about. Those of you who are familiar with my Let's Plays or uh, regulars on the channel, you'll probably already know what this is about, so really you'll just uh, get to watch me unbox the game and, uh, and boot it up and all that. So, yes, so I have Ultra Sun. Uh, that's going to be the copy I am playing. I have Ultra Moon coming in the mail, but that's too slow. I can't wait. I gotta start now. Um, so, my blind Let's Play. Uh, the way this works is... I have... For those of you who are new, uh, I am a member of the GBA, the Global Battle Association. That's one of the uh, original Pokemon Draft League um, battle things. And so I am surrounded by an amazing community of Poketubers who know a lot about the game. And after our season is over, uh, I kind of disconnect a little bit. I, I really distance myself from the, the chat rooms and from Twitter as much as I can. And I try and avoid all spoilers that could possibly come my way about the next Pokemon games once they've been announced. So once Pokemon Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon got announced, I kind of said, like, see you guys later. And I stopped being very active in the Discord uh, and on Twitter, really just checking in every now and then saying hi, hey, I'm not dead, things like that. Uh, the social element of it, but not so much talking about Pokemon, talking about meta or anything like that. Um, and in doing so, I'm able to avoid um, a lot of the updates about the game that come out or discoveries about the game that come out from people who either uh, leak content or see official releases from Nintendo. So I usually succeed in avoiding almost all of those, except in very sparse scenarios. So I've been able to avoid almost all of them and so what that gives you is a fresh look at me experiencing the game without already knowing elements of it so there are other let's plays where people they already know what they're getting into they already know what they're gonna see and so they're just they're playing the game to experience it which is great um, but I just have a slightly different view on it just because I know much less than maybe other uh, Poketubers would know uh, but with the added benefit being that it's not like I'm dumb to Pokemon, I'm a competitive battler, so I, I understand the game. So you get to watch me, someone who understands the game, learn about the game as I play through it. So um, that's sort of that's sort of my where I'm going with the uh, with the whole blind let's play thing. But I will warn you guys about one thing, uh, and that is that I'm not a hundred percent spoiler free. Some things did. Uh, get spoiled for me. I have to check into discord every once in a while to talk shop about the GBA and sometimes things pop up So if you are a hundred percent spoiler free uh, skip this part uh, Because I will be saying to everybody else uh, for full disclosure what it is that was spoiled for me So skip ahead now uh, Just you're done with the video. Bye. Thank you for stopping by <laughs> um, What was spoiled for me uh, was I know there's a new Lycanroc form. Uh, Nintendo put out an official video on that, and unfortunately, that I that I did get I did get that spoiled for me. Uh, the other thing that I saw discussed in chat is that apparently Defog is on a lot of Pokemon now. Now I don't know how. Maybe it's a new tutor. Uh, maybe it's a TM now, and they just made it that more Pokemon can learn it. I'm not sure. I just know it's going to be more omnipresent in uh, in League play from now on so uh, those are the only two things I uh, that really got spoiled for me so everything else I think I actually did a better job than I did with regular Sun and Moon because I think a lot more got spoiled for me in that like uh, the Thunder Wave accuracy going down things of that nature um, so the only other thing to sort of explain to you um, is kind of how my gameplay is gonna work in this let's play just so you know what you're getting yourself into You don't invest a bunch of time and decide that this really wasn't the way you wanted to go um, I kind of play through I do some voices for some of the characters if they're major characters. I'll kind of give them a voice um, and I skip through mundane battles so non-major ones random encounters in the wild if it's not the first encounter um, if I'm 
doing something unique with that encounter that you guys need to be present for, great. But if I'm really just mashing, you, we all know Pokemon. We know if you're just mashing buttons just to get the battle over as soon as possible. I'll show you the intro to the battle, who I see, and then I'll show them fainting. But I'm not going to show you me clicking away 20 times, especially if it takes two or three hits for me to take it out. That won't be fun for you guys. Um, so certainly midway through and later on in the in the game, that will be happening a lot uh, for. Uh, totem battles or uh, Elite Four, or anything like that. I don't skip those. I don't, uh, you know, I don't skip important battles so you guys can experience them with me. Especially because sometimes they're a little harder, and so playing smart actually does uh, matter. But for just the purpose of leveling as I'm going along, I don't show you guys that. I don't think you need to see it. So I'll do a little like cut, cut phase and all that, uh, and then. For the most part, I will almost always end an episode and then just pick it back up again. The only exception is if there's something I have to go back to do. Like, oh, I was supposed to... I ended an episode and I'm about to board a ship or whatever. But I was supposed to go back to grab something first. And really all you were going to watch is me riding my bike or running on, or whatever uh, back and forth. I'm not going to show you guys that. Uh, I'll still record it so I can mix master this in um, in uh, post production. So I'll have all that footage. So if something does happen that's unique on that that uh, Tauros run or the bike ride or anything like that, then I will be able to show it to you guys. It'll be a little cut like, oh look, by the way, guys, uh, this popped up when I thought it was just going to be a boring run. So. You guys will be able to see what I have for you, uh, but hopefully it'll it'll minimize the amount of time that you spend watching me do nothing. So that's all I got for you guys now. I'm gonna go take a shower, and when you guys uh, see me next, I will be ready to go, ready to experience uh, Pokemon Ultra Sun with you all uh, in a blind fashion. So uh, thank you for choosing me as your let's play uh, whenever you've decided i i hope i can do my best to give you guys a really fun show so as always my name is jim leader geo you guys are the challengers thanks for stopping by and i'll see you guys next time